Hi guys, it's Savannah again here at Golden Wings. Avery is doing our nest checks. Now, something really surprising happened uh, just now, so I just opened the box and we have had another little hatchling. So that's really exciting. So, what we have uh, to show you first off um, is this little one here. So this little one was getting a little bit squished and you can usually tell when they're finding it a little bit difficult because um, they're, they go a bit of a funny colour. Um, the, the crops kind of don't um drain essentially i suppose as as it normally would and they, they just kind of give up uh, so we noticed that this one was struggling a little and this one has now been fostered over as you can see it's being fed really really well by um penelope so that one's fine so that one is a biological to daenerys and d'artagnan and hopefully hopefully what we're expecting uh, to do is that that baby will be growing big enough and then we can pop that back to Daenerys and D'Artagnan to just ease the pressure off mum here because she's got quite a large clutch. Uh, so she's uh, she's got one, two, three, four, five babies there, um, which isn't too bad. But again, we don't really want, um, especially as a first time mum, we don't want her being too um, stressed. So this baby here is a foster from Daenerys and D'Artagnan, this little one here. This little one here is a foster from Daenerys and D'Artagnan. There you go, nice and fed, lovely. No colours as of yet, obviously they're still tiny, tiny. And also this one is a foster from Daenerys and D'Artagnan. Um, so they are all related, they are all siblings. But these two little gorgeous tiny babies, this one here is our new little hatch from, um, a little, from today. I uh, don't know when, I did check it earlier, so it's literally probably only hours old. Um, this baby here, and also this baby here, um, these babies are um, half exhibition and half standard. So these are going to look very different as they grow up to our, st uh, our standard babies. Okay, nice full crop there. They're going to look very, very different to those standard babies. These are so tiny. Um, so in size wise, they'll be a lot bigger. Um, their crests uh, may be very different. Um, and they're also their feathering will be a lot more. So um, obviously because they're split, we don't know what we're gonna get. Um, we know that the parents are greys, so greys in probably varying degrees, but you know with archers and shady's nest, there is a little sneaky blue that was in there. So definitely a surprise, and I am really, really excited for these ones because this is the first time that we've actually bred XEs in some shape or form. Even though they are split, um, it's definitely, it will be nice to see how different that these babies come out compared to the other ones. So um, that is going to be our last vlog for you this evening. Um, just because in eight, uh, we obviously have no more eggs, we have no more babies other than our little uh, number 75. So while we are on the subject of those babies, don't forget guys, we do have uh, number 73, so that was Lucky, um, he also, he's still looking for his home, so if you are interested guys, you need to message me ASAP, the last time I put a baby up it was gone within the hour, um, so you can secure that baby, he will be with you before Christmas. So he is a yellow faced violet, he is part hand reared um, and he was also fostered to Flash Lorraine who did a fantastic job raising that baby and treating them like uh, their, uh, he, treating him like their own. Uh, he's over into the nursery now so it's literally probably a week or, or two weeks and then he can go to his new home. So if you are interested, I say it again, you need to inbox me immediately, you need to reserve that baby to secure that baby. And uh, yeah, and we can get him all ready for you um, and he can be in his new home before Christmas. So that's what we want. Um, we want him to have his new home. So obviously um, uh, Faith and Hope have found their forever home. So we just want Lucky to find his now. All right guys, so um, the next lot that will be coming up to age, uh, fledging age, will be nest number six. They are the more developed, but they, they, are, they are still quite far behind. So again, another couple of weeks. So if you do want that baby, we do recommend that you message us about uh, 73. Otherwise, there will be a two-week wait for any more at least. All right, guys, well, thank you very much for watching our video. And fingers crossed that these little guys are absolutely fine. Obviously, with them being newborns, it is always a risk. Um, and, yeah, we hope that everything goes fine. And we can update you in a couple of days with our new vlog. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Bye-bye.